I'm blessed. I really am. I mean, um, I get to live the life I want to live. But the one thing that grounds me are my relationships with my people. And when I say my people, I'm talking about my family and friends. That's the one thing that keeps this glue all together for me. If it wasn't for my friends and my family, I wouldn't even be wanting to hustle this hard or I wouldn't be out here doing what I do. And all of this to say is the people closest to you that you should cherish. Treat them like they're strangers every day. Don't, I'm sorry, excuse me. Don't treat them like they're strangers. What you do is you embrace them like you embrace yourself. If you want good for yourself, you should want good for those that's closest to you. And you should treat them with the utmost respect because they're a direct reflection on you. If something is wrong in your life, people are going to, people are going to look to them to, for the answers because they know you best. You have to treat the people who know you the best. Don't treat the strangers the best. Treat your family and friends as good as you treat yourself. And if you don't treat them good, that means you don't treat yourself good. And what happens when you don't treat yourself good? What do you think the end result is? So you should treat those that's closest to you the best. You should give them the utmost respect. You should love them as much as you love yourself. It's a reflection when somebody meets them. If All right. Relationship advice. Guys, if you are unsure of a woman... I can't talk for women, but if you are unsure of if you should get with her or not and you, and you don't know what to look for, she's pretty, blah, 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 but you don't know if she's worth your time, here's a good way to tell. Have her introduce you to her best friends. Listen to the way they speak to each other. Listen to how her friends treat her. If her friends look at her with that look in that eye of admiration, that's a good thing. Very good thing. But if her friends go, oh, bitch, if they talk to her like that, not a good thing. Horrible. If she talks to her friends like that, that's how she's going to talk to you, my guy. Take heed for all my young, my young grown kings out there. Take heed. More importantly, have her introduce you to her parents. If she doesn't have her parents in her life, God forbid they pass away, have her introduce you to her aunt. Her grandmother, listen to their conversation. If the grandmother's loving, oh baby, and she takes to that, you gotta keep her. It don't matter what she look like, you keep that woman. But if her grandmother talked to her really bad, if her mom talks to her really bad, if her father doesn't pay her no attention, that's what you're gonna inherit, my guy. That's what it's gonna be moving forward. For all my young ladies who heard what I just said, if you have trouble searching for a guy, take a look at your friends. Look at the relationship you have with your parents and those closest to you. And if you don't have a guy and you and if you have all those people look at you and admire you and they treat you really well, they don't curse you out, they don't diss you, you don't diss them and you ain't got a guy. I don't know what to say. I ain't going to hold you. I, I just don't know many people like that. You know, women who, who definitely have a lot of respect from their family and friends and such, they have men. And I'm not saying all of them because I don't know. Disclaimer, I don't know. But chances are those women who got that love, they got a man. The women who got that respect from their friends and those that know them best, they got a man. They got a husband and they about to have kids. So that's just my advice for the day. I don't even know if that was advice. That's just my thoughts. I showed you around my hotel room. Hey, listen. Oh, by the way, I know I'm doing those those vlogs that had the straight vertical type. Everybody doesn't like it. Listen, when I first saw it, I didn't like it neither. I need content, my guy. I need to hit my 35 videos or my 50 or whatever that. The algorithm thing that YouTube does in order to get in the algorithm. Listen, okay? You mad? All you gotta do is listen. Ain't no biggie. Just watch the video. If you don't like the video, put the thing on pause, like turn the volume down, let the video run. Do me a favor. You already subscribed. And if you didn't, subscribe. Subscribe. Hit the like button. 
Matter of fact, don't even do that. Send that cash out. You know where my iPhone is. I stick to YouTube. It's like TV. 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 I stick to YouTube, 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 it's like TV.